So in this video, uh, me and my sisters are using jelly plates and I thought I'd take this time just to explain a little bit how they work. So um, I bought my jelly plates off of Amazon and you can get like cheaper brands. It doesn't, you don't have to have the actual brand jelly plate and I think you can even make them, which I may try and do one day because it's quite cool if you can make your own shapes. Um, but the basic premise of a jelly plate is something that you can um, do a kind of mono print with uh, without having the press so what you do is you put a small amount of acrylic paint um, onto the jelly plate and you roller it on and you can use tools so I've used like cake tools and stencils and things like that to make a sort of impression in it and then you get a piece of paper and uh, press it into the jelly plate and it will give you the pattern of whatever you kind of impressed on it and um, it's a very effective way of making collage materials or they look great as pieces themselves and they look really good on fabrics um, so we just had a fun day really and um, yeah it was really fun hanging out with my sisters doing this for the day so jelly plates are like um, a sort of squishy material uh, jelly as you would imagine. Mono printing is where you have a printing press and it's kind of like a, a winding handle and it basically means that you put a maximum amount of pressure onto the plate so instead of doing that in because obviously buying a printing press would be quite expensive uh, you're taking away the need for the pressure element so you don't have to press as hard because the jelly plate is obviously sort of a squidgy type material so it'll pick up your design uh, nice and easily. I recommend if you're doing jelly plates to do like uh, layers because it looks so much better when you use two or three colours and you can create some really kind of unusual looking almost like they've been made on a computer kind of prints um, and I'd recommend it as a really good activity for children too because it's not too difficult for them. Fetch this lovely messy workspace. Oh, great, Lizzie, what a cool sculpture. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> oh, wow. This is looking nice. What the colours? <laughs> Karen. Karen speaks. <laughs> oh, dear. Where are you at? <laughs> I fashioned it from um, that famous. Frida Kahlo? No? No, Royal. Ooh. Beatrice? Is it Beatrice that wore the funny hat to winning? Oh, Eugenie. Eugenie. Oh, well. Gorgeous. Eugenie. Fascinator. Actually, that looks a little bit like something you would see in a magazine. Vogue. Lizzie's more of a sculptor, really, aren't you? Yes, I'm very You see things three-dimensional. I like your newspaper. You should cut that up and make like collage with it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Review. What do you think, do you think Latte? latte? Oh, sniff it. Sniff test. Oh, not very you interested like then. It could be a frisbee. <laughs> wow, that's <laughs> that's a no. Two. Have you come to do an art review, Twilight? What do you no. think, Twilight? He loves it. <laughs> he loves it. Look. What? What? Get, get away from my bowl. <laughs> oh, it could be a cat treat holder. Cat. You can oh, put treats in the holes. Cat hand. Let's try it. Should we put a treat in? No, I don't want to do it. They're going to eat it then, aren't they? Just broken. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. 
multi-purpose. Oh, brilliant, Liz. Just sniffed it. Recognises quality or not. <laughs> and walks away. <laughs> Number three, art review. I'd rather look at this piece of fluff. <laughs> this <laughs> Hello Hi. Saffron hmm? All right Oh she's scared <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> A very tolerant kitty. Ah, <sighs> it's really hot in this car, in this coat. I've just finished um a not finished. I just came back <laughs> from seeing my sisters and we had a little art session today which was really fun and also I got to cuddle my sister's cats uh, which is always fun so yeah I'll show you the drawings I made or rather the jelly plate prints I made yeah <laughs> I'm so red <laughs> here are the prints I'm sorry they're very messily laid out I made quite a few I like this one I also like peeling um, the paint off of the jelly plate um, once you've finished with it to clean it as well as to kind of get this cool so you get sellotape and you just put it on top of the plate and peel it off it's kind of satisfying as well yeah so that's that's the prints I'll probably use them for collage pieces My overweight candle. Oh dear. You spent too much time in the sun. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video of 80% cats, 20% art. <laughs> Nevertheless, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye bye. What a handsome boy.